Good morning, everyone. It is 5.40. Hope everyone has a wonderful Thursday. We're almost at the weekend again. How crazy has this week gone so fast? Anyway, hope you have a wonderful day. Ash is getting ready for work. She's got to leave in half an hour. That's why I'm up now. I was up a few times in the night. But um, Pete is going to work from home today. Yay. Oh, I could use a nap. <laughs> I'm a mess. Anyway, I'll talk to you in a bit. Let's watch it in the news. There's a buffalo loose in Connecticut, and Luna finds that very interesting. Very interesting. Hello, everyone. It is a little after one. I have not vlogged. He got up around 9.15, he needed it, because he was up at 3 o'clock in the morning on his computer. He couldn't sleep, he wasn't feeling the best. So I was not about to wake him up this morning. Luna's in with him now. We've had a couple of parents come pick up pictures. I've had a chat with my mum. Wolves are going to be playing at 2 o'clock. I thought it was 3, but it's actually 2. But it's not televised, so I probably won't watch it, because if it's on my computer, it's going to get hung up. Avon did a live um while i was on the phone with mum so i'm gonna go watch the replay but i need to eat something i'm very hungry i had some cereal around seven o'clock um ash left at 6 15 i think i already told you that she should be getting off around four um yeah it's just a normal day it's nice having pete working in the office i don't have to worry about luna um i'm eager for my avon to ship i keep checking to see if that's going to ship soon because if it ships today it's thursday i should get it saturday which just county oh if i do this by the way i realized i did that in the vlog yesterday and the other day and i didn't explain to you what i was doing i was actually reading a text that came in because i'm still taking it on my phone because i keep forgetting to bring the camera down but anyway guys um i'm gonna go have something to eat because i'm starving um i will talk to you all in a little bit nice. It was supposed to rain today, we never got any. It's up to scray ish. Ash came home and she went to Queen's. <laughs> she wasn't going to go tonight, but never mind. Change of plan. Pete's watching the Board of Education meeting. And I'm about to watch some English comedies or something. And then we're going to eat around 7 30 so I can watch Big Brother at 8 and see who gets thrown out of the house tonight. Guys, I've been watching this Netflix series. It's called Last Tango in Halifax. It, I think it's from 19, 1916. It absolutely is not. It's from 2016. And I'm only on the first season. I think there's three seasons. And I'm on the fifth episode. It's in England. Lynn, I was thinking of you. You might like this. Um... I, there's not much I want to say about it because I don't want to give it away but I find myself laughing at it and then there's bits where I'm like ooh and then I'm like ha ah. <laughs> so it's a sweet story mum might like it too I gotta mention it to mum tomorrow so it's Last Tango in Halifax and it's about two separate families we'll just say that I think someone out there may enjoy this so I just wanted to share it and it's up north Oh dear. Oh, I thought I was videoing before and it was actually just on the ceiling. Um, I think it's time to turn this down a bit. Just turn it lower. I'm getting ready to go down. So it's only 6.30 and I said we'd eat at 7.30, but I'm hungry. Um, I had a sandwich for lunch and I had my cereal at like 6.30, 7 o'clock this morning. Uh, Wolves lost, but it wasn't. This wasn't the Premier League, even though they were playing another British team. I don't know. It wasn't the Europa League. It was something else. But uh, no one seems bothered by the loss. <laughs> I guess. I guess it wasn't that big a deal. But um, yeah, that's why I couldn't find it on the TV. I think. Anyway, guys. Oh, all I did was yawn in yesterday's vlog. And then when I was editing the vlog this morning, I was yawning again, yawning at myself, yawning in the vlog. And I'm going to be doing it again. So anyway, I'll love and leave you for a bit. And um, we'll talk to you in a little while. having a delicious dinner tonight. We got some meatloaf and mashed potatoes from Costco. And I just made 
some gravy and put some mushrooms in it so we've got a bit extra so guys the uh, meatloaf was absolutely delicious having that gravy with the mushrooms in just made it for the potatoes because they put like a ketchup kind of mixture on top of the meatloaf I, I do like mine with gravy it was delicious I ended up putting one of the pieces back Pete I always say just one piece and Pete goes oh this one's just a little piece and I knew I wouldn't be able to eat it so I ate the one piece and then Pete ate the other piece I had <laughs> so there's definitely enough left look what they have on instead of the fish now for when the game is off play and you can't see what's going on in the house because they're finishing up a competition right now. And they have puppies instead of those fish. I love the puppies. I want them all. But no, because they're going to be... Are they Jack Russells? I don't know what they are. I wonder if that's like in um, a humane society. Oh, <laughs> he's just walked over his brother's head. Oh, now he's curled down and put his head on his back. So cute. I wonder if they do this and then people can adopt them. Probably. The one in the middle is like, excuse me, you two, I am not your cushion. Look at the little blonde one in the middle. Hopefully you can see. This one here keeps like moving. Like, do you guys get off my head? And he's put his head right over. So cute. So cute. Anyway, um, I'm going to love and leave you for this evening. I feel like I've, yeah, I did something to my lip. But, uh, it's like cracked and it's not even cold, so... Um, that's one thing in it about winter. I've just ordered some lip balms. But um, I'm going to love and leave you guys for this evening. I hope you had a wonderful, wonderful Thursday, whatever it is you did today. Hope it was a good one and we will definitely see you tomorrow. Take care, guys, and stay safe.